Love was in the air for the Sweetheart's Luncheon at the Villa Barone Manor, and the only requirement for this private event hosted by Bronx Borough President Ruben Diaz Jr., a marriage of 50 years or more. First place winners, Josephine and Vincent Beretta, who is 92 years old. They've been married for 70 years. I took care of him all these years. That's why he looks so good. With laughter a main ingredient of their success, the other is patience and endurance. When you get married and you struggle, it's the best thing. Anything that comes easy is no good. Yes, uh-huh, whatever you say, honey. And married for 28 years himself, Diaz Jr. shared that the Sweetheart's luncheon he hosts each year on Valentine's Day, featuring ballroom dancers from PS72, is an opportunity to both admire and acknowledge these couples from the Bronx. Today is a celebration of love. And I believe that the word love is the most powerful word in the universe. And when you exhibit love, is the, is the number one thing that we can, it's the most powerful thing that we could do as human beings. And what greater example than to celebrate it here in the Bronx with couples who have been married over 50 years. We have a very elite group of people who are partying inside, who are maybe up there in age, but put us all to shame with their energy. Uh, I myself have been, have been with my wife for 28 years. And, and you, think about, you think about this thing called love, that it's not easy, that, that you have to work on day in and day out. Uh, that in this case, with the folks that you see there, have outlasted brick and mortar. Uh, and so we, we are here joined by our dancers, uh, Young World and PS72. Uh, but we, we're celebrating love on St. Valentine's Day, and we're doing it the right way uh, by acknowledging and recognizing those couples who have persevered and, and are a model, not only to Bronxites, but to New Yorkers and the rest of the country as to what it means to really be, truly be in love. And another feeling the love key sponsor, George Holtz from Health First. Oh, this is a very important day for Health First. To celebrate people in the Bronx who've been married 50 or more years is quite outstanding. And outstanding is a great way to describe Francis and Arthur's marriage. But we're very close, really, really close, like sisters and brother. We're good friends. We breakfast every morning in bed. Brings me coffee and makes pancakes or eggs. That's Fran Stein talking about her husband of 60 years, John Stein. He told you that. <laughs> well, they've been married for 50 years or more. They have stood the test of time. And the borough president is saying that this is love in the Bronx. For Bronxnet, this is Arlene Makoko.